second most exciting moment of this evening has arrived. Our judges have chosen the five finalists who will go on to compete for the Miss Universe title. The ballots have been marked. Our accountants have tabulated them, and they have compiled a list of five lucky delegates. Now, may I have that list, please, Miss Hospitality? Thank you. These are the five girls who will go on to compete for the title of Miss Universe. The first of our five finalists is Miss U.S.A. Miss U.S.A. is one of the five finalists. The second girl is a girl who's been one of your favorites all evening long. She is Miss Philippines. The next young lady is a young lady for whom you've applauded more each time you've seen her. She is Miss Norway. Our fourth finalist is Miss Israel. Here we have four of our five finalists. One more of the 12 semi-finalists. One more girl for this pedestal right here. Ladies and gentlemen, that girl is Miss Spain. Congratulations, finalists. Five questions here, and each girl will choose a question, and then we'll listen to her impromptu answer, and we're going to start with you, Miss Spain. Step right down here, Miss Spain, please. Here. And may I have the Spanish interpreter, please? Now, Miss Spain, will you select one of these questions? Just take one. Very good. Now, would you come up here with me, please? The question that I want Miss Spain to answer is this. If your little sister or a friend were to enter this pageant next year, what advice would you give them? Ella pregunta, ele pregunta que se tu tienes para el ano próximo uma 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 irmã que uma irmã se tienes se la aconsejas para venir aqui? Ou um amigo? Ao mesmo universo, no próximo ano. Sí, le aconsejaría porque vale la pena nada más que por tratar con tantas niñas de diversos países, de tantas nacionalidades distintas, convivir y saber más o menos el modo de pensar de cada una. Además, una experiencia muy importante y que todas chicas debería de tener, pero solamente se le dan a privilegiada y hay que dar siempre las gracias. Yes, now would you please tell us just briefly what did she say? She says uh, she will advise her sister to come here because it was a very good experience. Uh, not only because uh, they are girls uh, from every country, it, uh, it will be a very good enriched experience for any woman in the world. Very good. Thank you very much, and thank you, Miss Spain. <laughs> now, Miss Israel, would you please step down here? Take one of the questions. Your question is this. If you had to stop being you and become somebody else, who would you want to be and why? Uh, too expensive. In Hebrew. In Hebrew? Yeah. May I have the Hebrew interpreter, please? All right. While they get someone who speaks Hebrew, would you please step back up there? Would you step down here, Miss Norway? Take one of these three questions. <laughs> Your question is, you've had a chance to see how the people of Athens live. How does it differ from the way people live in your hometown? Oh, that was a difficult question, I think. People here is uh, very warm, and um, uh, they're looking at in the, on each other, and they uh, don't care to talk with strange people on the street. In Norway, we doesn't do that. And um, that's... Um, mm. Oh, it's difficult to answer. I English. get the impression, though, that they are more friendly and warm. More impulsive, yes. And, and display their emotions. Yeah. Yes. Thank you, Miss Norway, very much. <laughs> now, Miss USA, would you please step down here? Take one of these two questions. And your question is, 
You've been away from home for about 10 days. What is the first thing you're going to do when you get home and why? Many people will ask me the first thing, how is Greece? What is it like to be home? The people in this country have made me feel so at home that all I can do is take them back with me and that's what I'm going to tell my folks when I get home. Very nice. Miss USA. Now, Miss Philippines, this is the remaining question. This question is for you. Your question is, let's make believe that all of a sudden, this is a perfect question for her. Let's make believe that all of a sudden you had a million dollars. <laughs> What's the first thing you would buy and why would you buy it? A house and lot, because <laughs> it's the most expensive thing and I can't afford it. So if I have a million bucks, I'll buy a house and lot and live by myself <laughs> and other people, of course. Thank you very much, Miss Philippines. Now, Miss Israel, would you step right down here? Now, your question, and uh, this lady speaks Hebrew, would you step over here on my left, please? And uh, her question was... If you had to become, stop being you, and become somebody else, who would you want to be and why? May I ask? I understand now. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for your tremendous contribution <laughs> to this show. Um, I think I want to be a great scientist which, because I think that science is the most important fact, uh, value in our lives, but the uh, instructive science, not the destructive science, for war purposes, for instance. So, science helps humanity, and this is my aim in life. Thank you, Miss Israel. <laughs> Judges, you've heard our five finalists. We await your decision. Who will be Miss Universe for 1973? Now, while the judges are busy marking their most important ballots of this evening, I'd like to introduce the reigning Miss Universe for her traditional walk and words of farewell. Let's welcome Miss Universe of 1972. Here is Carrie Ann Wells of Australia. As my year's Miss Universe ends, I would like to thank the people of the world for teaching me that we are all one people capable of living happily together in the light of evolutionary progress and universal love. To Miss Universe 1973 and her 60 beautiful runner, I wish success and happiness, and remind them that the beauty of the body in time gives way to the eternal beauty of the soul. And my big friend, Katos Oronos Monsan Misifilia Stalioni, Telo Nai Parestiso Olos Tos Anthropos to Cosmo, Pomo Emethan, Oji Oli Maste Anthropi, Ikani Nasume, Etihis Meni Masi, Stofos Tis Prozu, Ketis Lakapis. <laughs>